Hello everyone and thanks for purchasing this needed Photoshop action. In this tutorial, I will show you how to install and use this needed Photoshop action and how to get maximum result for this. So, after you purchasing this action, you need to download the zip file and to the installation, please extract the zip file first. Just double click if you are on the Mac and if you are on Windows, just right click on the zip file and click extract here. And let's go to the folder. Inside of that extracted zip file, you will get two folders inside. There's an action folder and Christmas ornament folder. Let's open the action folder first. And in this folder, you will get four Photoshop action files, one Photoshop brush file, and two Photoshop pattern files. Let's open Photoshop for the installation. To install this action, click the window tab and select action. And the panel action like this will show. Click menu on here and select load action. Go to the extracted folder. Open the action folder. And as we know, there's a four photos of action files. Let's lay it all and click open. And all of the action file is just installed. After the action file is installed, let's install the Photoshop brush file and Photoshop pattern files. You can go to edit, preset and select preset manager. And click load. And as you can see, there's a one Photoshop brush file. Click open, and the function of this brush is to adjust the pixel on the image. Let's install the pattern. Select pattern on the preset type, click load, and select both of this pattern file. Let's click open, and after all, the pattern file is successfully loaded. This pattern will be used for the action later. And just click done. And this needed Photoshop action is ready to use. Let's get some image to start it. This needed action can be used for an image like a photo, vector, text, or anything else to be converted to needed style. In this time, I will start with make object. I make a hard step object. Let's give some color on it. I think it's good and should. Sure. I think I will duplicate the shape because I will try all of this style. So you can see the difference between all of them. Select the style action and select the size what you want. And this time will be, uh, we'll start with need a small with 18 pixel size. and click the play button. And after we click play button, the posterize window will show. And the function of this posterize is to adjust the color. So we can choose how many color on this image. When color is enough, you can click OK. And after that, the threshold level will show. The function of this is to adjust the edge of the pixel. In this time, maybe I will try with the lowest level. And you will get the dialog like this. If you think everything is okay, just click continue. But if you think you need to make some adjustment on the pixel, please click the stop button. Remove some pixel that you think is not needed. And after all, just click the play button again. Just wait a second. And this one is the result of needed small with 18 pixel size. Let's try another one. In this time, I will try with needed alert. Click on the object. Click on the layer object, 
click on need alert and I will select existing pixel again same as before and let's click the play button let's make some color adjustment we need to adjust the edge too maybe we search click stop because I think some adjustment is needed here everything is good and let's click the play again and here's the result of native large with 18 pixel size and for the third time let's try the needed solid style click on the solid and let's select 18 pixel gain and click the play button Uh, I think we should click stop. We need erase this part. And maybe it's good. And click the play button again. And here's the result. Can you see the difference? Let's try the last one. Let's select exit pixel again, click the object layer, and click the play button again, just okay. Uh, just stop maybe. Maybe we should remove this part. And click the play button again. Can you see the difference? The knitted small has small pattern size, have a nice realistic texture, but they are doesn't have transparent background. And the solid action, as you can see, they have a transparent background, even they doesn't have a realistic texture. Uh, this knitted large action have a bigger pattern than the knitted small action. The small knitted pattern and large knitted pattern can be used to make textured or realistic visualizations of your image maybe and the solid action is usually used to print needs or anything else. To get the maximum result of this Photoshop action, you can use a grid. Now uh, let's remove the object first. Let's go to uh, preferences. Click on here and go to the guide grids and slices. Make the grid same as the pixel size that you will use. In this time, I will use 50 pixel size of the needed Photoshop action. So I think I need to show grid action with 50 pixel size too. And let's click OK and select a few tab and select show and select grid. That's right. Let's make the object again. Make sure the size of the object is fit with the grid. I think it's good. Um, the most important thing of this is the object is must be fit to the grid because we show grid with 80 pixel so let's start with um 50 pixel with this style maybe let's click ok because the object is fit to the grid we don't need some adjustment so let's click continue and here's the result Let's try to hide the grid, maybe. Let's do this with the text object. On, I think I should remove this object first. Um, I make some type like um, Christmas, maybe. Yes. Um, let's scale it up. And this time, I think I need to change the background color. Click the OK and I think I should change the color text too. 
something more bright like white is good and it's solid 30 pixel and let's click the play button click ok and this time I think just continue and here's the result for the text let's do this again just drag it down move it down let's start with solid 40 pixel size and then click the play button again just click um okay maybe and continue and this is the result can you see the difference let's do this with the image object i think i should uh, place that image first with this image maybe well, let's try with nitty large with 15 pixel size uh 100 pixels maybe Just click on the play button again start with more color let's click ok continue and here's the result this is the result for knitted large with 100 pixel size let's try with uh knitted small with 100 pixel size let's increase the color just click ok and continue because we have nothing to adjust and that's all this one is for needed small with 100 pixel size this is the result if you try this action on the image so that's all from me please give me a feedback to make this needed action more useful and be better and please reach me out if you have any question thank you and see you next time